Hey Gypsies, welcome back to my channel. So it's Sunday, so typically that means I'm here with Fee, and we are gonna be doing a cooking and a crafting video with Gypsy and Fee. So what we found for the cooking video, I was in charge of the, finding something to craft. She was in charge of finding something to cook. So you wanna tell them what you decided on? I chose a sugar cookie bar. Sugar cookie and an icing and sprinkles. It looks delish. Where'd you find it? Pinterest. Pinterest. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll link that uh, recipe down below in the description box. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and start. I'm going to read the ingredients and she's going to hold them up just to show you what we're using. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, we have our matching Dollar Tree masks on. So they're adorbs. She thinks they smell like pickles. I think she just got done eating pickles. That's how she thinks. I haven't ate a pickle. It wasn't on your sandwich? No. Okay, never mind. Okay, guys. So, for the sugar cookie bars themselves, we are going to be using, um, we're going to double the recipe, of course. So, we're going to need one cup of unsalted butter. Okay, we're going to need eight ounces of cream cheese. Mm hmm. Two cups of white sugar. Oh, sugar. I hope there's two cups in there. <laughs> okay, um, if there's not, oh well, they won't be quite as sweet, right? Um, let's see here. Four teaspoons of vanilla. Four large eggs. Four and a half cups of all-purpose flour. Okay, four teaspoons of cornstarch, two teaspoons of baking powder, and a half a teaspoon of salt. Uh, so we're gonna, um, we need to get some more baking powder. Um, yeah, it's pretty old. Don't you have, you don't have any, do you? I don't even know. It's a, okay, the expiration date. <laughs> What is it? 2013. 2013. Okay, that's only seven years, so we should be good. Okay, so now I'm going to show you what we are going to, or I'm going to read off our frosting ingredients. Mm -hmm. So we need one cup of unsalted butter. More. Four ounces of cream cheese. More. Half a teaspoon of salt. Salt. 23 cups of powdered sugar. Two to three. It says two to three. So you're supposed to add it for as much sweetness. Okay, okay, two to three cups of powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. And one teaspoon of vanilla. <laughs> so, okay, we, okay, let me just say, I forgot the tripod today, so we have the camera setting up on boxes and leaned against a bag of flour. So it's going to be, we're going to try to get a good camera angle for, so you can see exactly what we're doing. We're going to go ahead and start off mixing the sugar cookie dough or... What's it called? Mix? Um, it's, it's dough. It is actually dough. Is it? It's, it's real thick and you have to um, spread it out in the... Okay, so we did stop by Dollar Tree and grab two of these 13 by 9 inch. No! I don't feel like these are 13 by 9. Did you not get 13 by 9? I don't know. I thought they looked like it. There has never been one episode that everything goes 100% and we if, have 100% everything. If there was, y'all would probably just turn it off. So, y'all like to watch all of our mistakes, right? It literally just says lasagna pans. Lasagna pans. Okay, so that's what we're using, guys. I mean, we're just going to keep an eye on the, the dough or whatever. So, anyway, I'm going to stop the video. We'll be right back with a different angle showing you how we mix it up. Okay, guys, Fifi is going to be adding the cream cheese and the butter to the bowl. And this is the best view that we could kind of get without the tripod. So bear with us on today's video. I'm going to be measuring out the sugar, and then we're going to beat these ingredients together. Uh, this is the, uh, see if we have two cups of sugar. And we do. Yeah. I guess. That's we're almost good. there. Oh, I'm not done yet, oh. though. Why don't you do your stuff and quit worrying about mine? <laughs> <laughs> and we do. Is that two cups? I can't see. A little bit more, maybe? That's lopsided. I know. Why does this look sideways? Cat's eye. Oh, 
let me have that. Cream cheese so hard to open lately. It's like it used to not be like this. <laughs> Back in the good old days. Back in my day, cream right, cheese guys. used to be easy to We're open. We're good with two cups of sugar. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour it in. Do we also need sugar for the uh powdered? Oh good. Yeah. So I pour in the sugar in and she still has not got bro. This cream cheese. Okay. <gasps> Let me help you with the butter. We need two of these bad boys in this batter or dough or <laughs> happy Sunday guys. Hope everybody's doing good and had a good weekend. We got Jack here with us today, but she's going to be off camera. She's just chilling in the living room, playing games and playing Jenga and watching TikTok. All right. You know what? These say softened, and these are not softened. Well, it's going to have to work. I know, but they've been sitting out forever. They just don't feel I soft. know. Probably because it was 54 degrees when we came in here this morning, right? Actually, it's 50. Thank you. So, Fifi made me a good cup of coffee. She made a Colombian roast in the Keurig, and she put some peppermint creamer in it for a Christmas vibe. Peppermint mocha, the best. Okay, mixer time. Okay, guys, we are going to mix it like we ain't never mixed anything in our lives. Why? Why? Hey, psst, psst. hey, I'm gonna do it. You got, you got to turn it down. We can't let. It, yeah, but if music plays, I can't, I can't have music playing on my video. I'll get in trouble. <clears throat> Okay. Mixings. Beaters. I guess I'm going for this, right? Yeah. Okay. Get everything out the way here. Uh, all, right. all right. Here we go, guys. This is going to be hilariously fun. What? <laughs> well, nothing's soft. Well, nothing's room temperature right now, so okay. wish me luck. I'm going to try to just kind of. It'll all be okay. Merry, merry, merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Hey, that's better than salt and pepper, right? Let's sing Christmas carols. You want to, Don? There he is. Don took off running when I said something about Christmas carols. Did you find any? No. Oh, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm just, I told you this is going to be fun. I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> Under the circumstances. No, I was asking if it was good. Mine's over there. I think you brought it in from the car. Where did it come from? So it's gonna start hating me after a while. There might be a couple pieces jump out. Oop. What can I do? Alright guys, we're gonna pause this until I get everything mixed up. Sorry about the hand all up in the screen. Okay, so we got this all beat up, and now we're going to add in four teaspoons of vanilla. And I think that fell back a little, and I can't mm. even hardly see the ball. Yeah, that's how it was. Four teaspoons of vanilla and four eggs. Okay. Then it says beat in vanilla and eggs. Oops. Different bowl. Oh, sift. Oh, I forgot to sift there. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, guys, so we're supposed to have sifted flour, cornstarch, baking powder, and salt. I was going to get a sifter or uh, something resembling a sifter at the Dollar Tree, but did I remember? All right. All right, how's it going? It's going. How's it going? So if it says to sift it and you don't sift it, what does that mean? Like, we need to have a different name for our baking show. Like what? Like something about messing up. <laughs> oh, like that? Cookie, yes. Oh. Yes, that's how we roll. Totally. Guys, if y'all can think of something funny but not too mean, Give us some tips on what to call this crazy baking show that we do because we are always messing something up. <laughs> Not really messing it up. We're always just goof ups, right? Um, those crescent rolls from the last time. Uh huh. They didn't turn out good. That was doughy. Do you know? They were so doughy. Boy, do you know? Um, <laughs> like. I had one when we got home, and I realized it was doughy at that point. But, like, all of the apple one was gone. And half of the cherry. Oh, it was kind of gagging me. <sighs> yeah, I was just pretending like it was cream cheese, but I just had one piece. All right, guys, I'm going to mix this up. Then we're going to get uh, the other ingredients ready, so we'll be right back. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Uh, come on. Okay, guys, we are going to go ahead and put the dry ingredients in here. I'm going to be measuring out the flour, which is five or four and a half cups, and she is going to do the other three. So you can tell them what you're doing. Uh, we need doing to do the cornstarch. Yeah. So we're doubling it, so we need four teaspoons. Of Where does this starch. come in? Oh, it comes in here. Okay. Four teaspoons. She's making a royal mess over here. Messiest cooks are the best cooks, right? Please say yes. <laughs> and two teaspoons of baking powder. I mean, like this is... <laughs> like I need to see the half here. <laughs> when you get done, trash that. That way that'll force us to buy more, okay? Mm -hmm. Or you could have just did a half a teaspoon. Ta-da! Like I said before, I hate math. And I only want to do it if it's going to save my life or get my cake to turn out right. And that's only every now and then. All right. Not a cake. <laughs> bars, bars. Okay, so sift that. Okay. Alright, done. <laughs> okay, we've sifted that. So next we are going to do, what we're going to do is carefully beat flour mix into the batter mixture. One half of a cup at a time. Butter mixture. <laughs> okay, I don't I have one glasses I was trying to write it down fast. I understand. One half okay. a cup at a time. So I will be mixing while you add in half a cup at a time. Actually, it says a half of it at a time. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. You know, though, I'm just going to keep adding cups so we don't make a mess. Okay, that sounds good. Okay, okay, let me get this. If that thing would stay up, we'd be doing it really good. Okay, guys, here we go. Bear with us. It's probably going to seem like you're on a ship. Here we go. Whoa. Okay, hold on.
See what this says. Spoon batter into the pan. Press into even layer. So we're going to put half in one pan, half in the other. So what I'm going to do is move the bowl over here so she can put the pans down. I'm going to go ahead and move that. Okay, move that. Move this over here. Okay. Meow. Meow. Whew. Let me get some of this flour up. Like that stuff was powdering up everywhere. Separate it evenly into the pans. Mm. Did you spray these? Yes. Okay. You just put it side by side there, or is that going to be good? How about I get around over here and get the camera and film you mm. at a better angle while you're doing it evenly? You want to do that? Sure. Okay, guys. Oh, well. Okay. Yeah, I can't even see. Right there? Yeah. Something tells me I'm not good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just do one each, one each side and then just keep it up till it's gone. Then it has to be e equal, right? Okay, hold on a minute. Okay, I just had to turn the camera around so I can actually see. You are doing great. <laughs> okay, there's like not even a, a spoon coming out. Oh. I got the look. So, hmm. just do the best you can do. Get two spoons. Work with two spoons. You get a spoon and you use the other spoon to scrape it off. I'll wash them up. Okay. Mm. This is sticky. Good job. Look at that. Woo. These are going to be good bars. Good bars. It says it's sticky, actually, because well, it says you spray your hand to. See? That means we did it right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's 
like, uh, it's like uh, glue or something. It is. It looks like glue. <clears throat> So it said to use your hand to do it? Mm -hmm. Well, I'll That's film you doing that too. Sprayer. Actually, you know, I think it's your turn to get filmed. I don't something. think. I think that you have got it all started and you know the directions and like, and that would be just fantastic. Utterly fantastic. You can see the consistency, guys. Very thick and sticky. You got a joke of the day? Joke of the day. I do not. Oh. Do you? No. Wait a minute. Let me think. What did one fried egg say to the other fried egg? If you know, leave it down below, guys. I was watching an episode of Hazel, which is a super old school sitcom, and she was telling a couple jokes, and that was one of them, and I just knew I'd remember the punchline if I'd actually said the joke. That's fine. That's fine. All right, so here goes the fun part. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Oh, my gosh. That's so sticky, bro. Is that going to work? Like, did you spray your hands enough? I don't know. Hold on. I can only spray my hands Maybe so I should much. reach and spray your hand a little bit. Okay. Try that out. Try that out, babe. I don't like this. Now, you know, sugar, sugar cookies are actually, you know, the sugar cookie dough is actually like that. I'm not good at it. You're doing great. Just do the best you can do. It's all you can do. Oh, my gosh. I don't like this. <laughs> How about spraying the back of a spoon? Like, well, I wonder if that would work any better. Like, the hands kind of... No, let me... Uh, bummer. Spray... Here, spray... I don't know. Spray down. Just going for it. Uh. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, we're going to work on getting this stuff spread out. We'll be back in a moment. Okay, guys, so here we have it as best as we could get it mashed down in there. Um, so I'm going to stick it in a 350-degree oven for about 22 to 25. It may take a little bit longer simply because our pans are not quite 13 by 9. So, we'll check it after about 23 minutes, and then we'll just kind of go from there. So, we'll be back to show you when we get it out of the oven. Okay, guys. Um, the How long did, did we bake that for? Oh, we started out at 23, and then we added 5, and then we added 15. So, so here's what the finished product looks like. I, I've inserted a knife. And it is all finished, and we have it in the freezers cooling right now. So, we're going to make the icing to go on top. And by the time we get that made, I think we're going to go ahead and icing them. So, basically, what we have to do is cream or beat the butter until soft. So, you want to put the butter in? Yep. How much do we need? Um, two, I think both of those. So, butter, one cup. So, that's two sticks. I'll go around here and put the beaters in. I need to work that off. Okay. Here's that. And 
what else? Cream the butter, butter. first until Beat. soft. Okay. Beat the butter until soft. Okay. So you do that. Let's see. And we're going to add the salt and vanilla. Oh, the cream cheese and then the salt and vanilla. cream cheese to make it like a cream cheese icing or extra mm -hmm. butter to make it a buttercream. Okay, so we are making it more of a cream cheese icing. I mean, that's how it can't, we have, I mean, you can't go wrong with extra cream cheese. No. <laughs> Half a teaspoon of salt and one of the milk. What did you do with the vanilla? Did you put it back? Oh, I did put it up. All right, sorry. Okay. Do half of this one. Yeah. That looks good. All right, and then one vanilla. Oh. And then you're going to stir or mix it, and we're going to add in the powdered sugar. Yes, which will be so messy. Yeah, two to three cups. We'll start out with two. You made us end with two. Alright. Mm, I can just eat this. Vanilla, cream cheese, butter. Mmm. So good. How's your Jenga block in here? I don't know. <laughs> she dropped it. Okay, there's that Jenga block. One cup at a time. Okay. I'm surprised there's not milk in here or something. Go for it. Well, you know we're going to need at least two cups. Fussies. Fussies. Two and then you can do 
do a taste test. Because I know you're dying to do a taste test. Mm. <laughs> I don't see how it could not be sweet enough, really. Right. Well, it is said to your um, sweetness and thickness. Okay. Gotcha. What's Actually, wrong? that should be like four to six. Yeah. Oh. How is it though, like right now? Why don't you do a taste test? How about you taste it and see? Oh my god. <laughs> okay. You're the one that loves it so much. Mmm. <laughs> it's so good. I don't know. I mean, to me, it tastes totally sweet enough. Okay. I mean, do you think this is going to be enough to ice bath, icing bath them? I don't know. I'm wondering. I wish you'd taste it. Because I'm just wondering. I mean, what are we going to... We doubled everything. It's got to be enough, right? Hmm. It tastes sweet when you first put it in, but then after you swallow it, don't taste as sweet. Should we add one more? How about like a half of a cup? A half? Yeah. Okay. I, guess, I don't know. Okay. I mean, oh no. Because normally, like when you do cheesecake and stuff, you actually add sugar, right? Like regular sugar. Yeah. Okay. We'll let that be up. Seems like so much. Was that salt in there in the bin too? Yes. I don't know. Do you think we should add another half cup? I don't know. I don't know. No, we'll leave that. So these are pretty much cooled completely. They're still a little tiny bit warm on the bottom, but I think that's gonna be fine. I'm gonna go ahead and set these here. I'm gonna go ahead and divide this mixture up half and half. With this bad boy right here. Like they didn't stick. Oh good. I mean, should we take them out? Hey, let's do. Because I don't like look a little bit better. Yeah. Okay, okay here. You grab okay. the paper. Okay. Here. Aww. Mm, it's fine. It's not like... Just... Okay. Use, use both hands. Alright. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay, guys. I'm going to divvy it up here. I think that'll be plenty. Mm -hmm. Actually, they're not. Gonna be, it's not going to be real thick on here, but I feel like I should have did like half on one side, half on the other. And then the sprinkles, mm -hmm. which is what's going to give it that Christmassy vibe. And the sprinkles that we're using, you can use whatever. But these are just. Oh, these are the non perils they, oh, where's the thing? So they're just like the little dots. And they're red, green, and white. And they're going to look all Christmassy. Mm -hmm. We'll get a good shot of putting those on after I'll hold the camera and let me sprinkle them on there. 
Mm, I think that's going to be good. It has to be. I mean, can't go wrong with sugar cookie and cream cheese icing, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's good. Okay. Good deal. Lucille. Mm. Mm -hmm. um, I'm trying to crumble on the side. I won't don't want I want nothing but white on top. For sure. Make it look all Christmassy like Christmas snow. I would actually love I'm gonna have to use the spoon here because I want to get all this off. Put on that corner. Put on that little Space. Hmm. Oh, yeah, hold on. I'm gonna hold the camera and let you do the sprinkling of the non heralds. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Let me hold on. I'm gonna turn the camera. All right, here we go. All right. oh, that's a Let's get colors. up in here. Oh, too many. That's white pepper. <laughs> Yeah, not too many. Just enough to make it look Christmassy, right? Okay. Grab this one. And these are going to be delicious. Gosh, these come out really nice. <laughs> that could have been a bad mistake. I like the looks of those, though. I think yeah. they're really pretty. Okay, so okay. there's what they look like. Yummo. Sugar cookie bars. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Should we cut up one and try it? Yeah, I mean, Do a little taste test? I'll just let get a, get you doing the taste test. Are you gonna try it? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. Just get you a little. We'll see how they come out too. <laughs> get you a little square. Why do I have all these? I just like if it's there it went. <laughs> Them little crunchy Dom Perils. Mm. <laughs> Is the bottom crunchy? Like mm -hmm. done, done? Is it overdone? Um, I think maybe it could have cooked a little bit less. A little bit less? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, at least she's honest, folks. Mm. How's the flavor, though? It's good. Is it good? Mm -hmm. It's not okay. overly sweet. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to get a good picture of these for the thumbnail. And... That's it, guys. Thank you for watching, and we'll be back next Sunday, Lord willing, and the creek don't rise. We're going to do another Christmas video of some sort, Christmas, yeah, recipe. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit like, and leave us a comment. Bye!